I mean, my claim is that you don't need a single safety system to make a light water reactor non-hazardous, like none. And Fukushima empirically demonstrated that. I don't need to argue it. It happened in 2011. So you said, I'm going to take, I'm going to take existing technologies, right? I think light water reactors is, is your path. It's been, yep. it's a well-known technology. It's been around since, since the beginning. It's, yep. it's, it's not a graphite reactor like Chernobyl. It's, it's actually known it's safe, right? When it, I think you talked about when it, at one point when it melts down, it's actually not a bad thing. Well, <laughs> actually. It, yeah. I mean, like Fukushima, you had three gigawatt scale reactors melt down. Every single safety system failed, including the roof. And not a single injury was caused. So it's like, hmm. yeah, it, I actually struggle to call nuclear safe because it was never hazardous to begin with. You know, I'm talking about, yeah, light water reactors. I'm not talking about Chernobyl, which is like a whole different category of things. That wasn't even a power okay. plant. That was a, a weapons factory that is like relabeled as a power plant in, in modern right. era. So it's like, yeah, that's but comparing apples to still a nuclear art. meltdown, right? What's that? Like Chernobyl. Chernobyl was still a, a nuclear It was not disaster. a meltdown. It was not a meltdown. It was not. No, it's, it was okay. a it was super explosion. critical yeah. explosion. It was, explosion right. it was a, it was a oh, nuclear yeah. explosion. It was like a HBO little show. bomb because it was designed in a way to make bombs. Like that's what graphite reactors were designed for. By the way, we have a bunch of we had a bunch of graphite reactors in the U.S. for our weapons program that were the exact same technology as the ones in Russia for their weapons program. So Fukushima is more is more the analog. And there's Three Mile Island. There's Fukushima, and you found I, I, that was a thought part I found interesting. When you actually melt down, you're actually halting the in a way halting the process, and it's yep. it's actually a design part of the design. All things can fail, yet it's still no one died off of this. Yeah. Right? So I mean, my claim is that you don't need a single safety system to make a light water reactor non hazardous. Like none. And Fukushima empirically demonstrated that. I don't need to argue it. It happened in 2011. Right, right. What we're doing is we're layering on all these extra safety systems to be able to navigate through regulators in a cost and time effective manner. 